Hello there guys, Wayne from Lunar's World. I hope you're well. Welcome to X-Plane 11 and welcome back to Chernobyl and um, and welcome to the Huey. We're in the Nimbus Huey. This is a, a really incredible uh, helicopter for X-Plane. Very, very difficult to fly as you're about to see. Um, but yes, this, is, uh, this video is following on from the video uh, that I did a couple of days ago, the Chernobyl experience. Um, Someone in the in the comments alerted me to the fact that there is um, free uh, scenery for Chernobyl, and it's actually really, really, really seriously good. So this is kind of going to be combining a first look of the Huey and also um, checking out the uh, scenery for Chernobyl. And we're going to fly around um, Pripyat. We're going to land in some pretty cool places. We're going to go to the reactor. There is a Geiger counter on board. Um, so we're going to be able to see what kind of radiation we've got going on. Um, but let's just see if I can get a nice little view here. Oh my word, this is such a difficult helicopter to fly. It really is. Okie dokie. Right, so we'll head over this way. And yeah, the scenery here really is quite something. I've placed it um, all on top of the ortho tile. Although I'm not sure it's actually depicting here at the moment. Need to check that out. Um, yeah, very not used to flying this at all, but I'm going to try my best not to uh, do things wrong. Oh yeah, so this is the radar over here, which is pretty awesome. Let's fly over there and have a look at it. How my boys in the back? Oh, I'll just drop the VR controller. That's never a good thing. Yeah, so here's the uh, the radar. What a cool structure. Pretty awesome. Okay. Let's head over this way to Pripyat. Okay, this is the town of Pripyat right here. So we'll do a low flight kind of around the perimeter and have a look at what buildings are modeled. I'm hoping the uh, the uh, hotel is modelled and the square with the statue in the middle. All right, let's do a right hand turn over this kind of wasteland. Over speed here a little bit. Okay, I think we've got the hang of it now. Alright, so let's um, go ahead and do a low pass over Pripyat and have a look, see what we can see. There's the square. And there's the Ferris wheel. So let's check this out. Wow, that is cool. Look at that. Oh, there is the statue there. That is awesome. Oh, we even have radio. Oh, that's spooky. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, my word. That is amazing. I want to land right next to the Ferris wheel in a second, but I want to have another look around here. Uh, where's the hotel? There's the hotel, I think. Is that it? Ah, oh, there it is. Wow, that's so awesome. It's 
very cool. Okay, let's see if we can land at the Ferris wheel. I think the best idea is that sort of clearance the other side. Let's go ahead and try and do that. And we'll actually get out. We'll, we'll uh, open the doors up. And we'll get out. Oh, this is so amazing. Very awesome stuff. Screw here. That's all right. Uh, that's not so good. Okay, let's try and get some kind of control. It'd be good, wouldn't it? Let's try not to hit a tree. Oh man, this is just not going so well. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, and clock. Hey. Okay, ridiculously hard landing. Um, okay, let's um, let's get out, have a look around. Oh, these are tall. <laughs> uh, there's our aircraft. Wow, that's so cool. Let's hop over here. Wow, that really is awesome. Look at that. Very cool. Should we go into the town? I know this is... I'm not quite sure where the square is. Okay, we better not. We'll probably get lost. Where's my helicopter? Oh, here's the town here. Wow, look at that. Wow, that really is something. Standing. Wow. Awesome work. Absolutely awesome work. Right, now to find my helicopter. Um, I'll tell you what, I can just do this. Okay, that is so cool. Very, very cool. Shame about the landing, but never mind. Um, okay, let's uh, let's head over to the reactor now then, and check out um, how it's being rendered. Because they it includes the 2017 uh, sarcophagus. stable in this at all. In fact, oh, I'm getting sick here. My, my frame rates have dropped for some reason. That's better. Whoa, kind of eerie. Very cool. And there's the reactor with, like I said, this sarcophagus, um, which was completed in 2017, which contains the, the old concrete um, casing that they put around their reactor in the core in 1990, 1986 so um, it had eroded basically and was in bad shape so this took I think 12 years to complete so pretty amazing and there's the Geiger counter Wow, that is phenomenal. Absolute top, top work. What a great job they've, they've done. Superb. And these are the other reactors. Wow, absolutely incredible. 
incredible. Is that the bridge of death right there? No. No, I don't think so. They actually built a solar power station nearby. Let's see if they've modeled that. I think it's right next to the All the old buildings. Well, the Geiger counter is really ramping up there. I don't see any sign of the solar power. Let's land down there. I want to land down there and get out and have a, have a look. It is pretty awesome. Oh, look at the green dust coming off. That's a nice touch. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, I want to just get out of here. And I want to go way over here and have a look inside. See how much they've actually modeled. Oh my goodness, we're actually inside the reactor. That's amazing. <laughs> so cool. So I guess this is the old um, concrete that was uh, encased go in. But that's so cool. That is very cool. Yeah, this is the old concrete casing. Wow. Very awesome. A ton of detail here. And then this is through the other side. It's part of the old concrete casing as well. Waste. Oh, man. What the hell? Why is there a pimp here? <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, contamination zone. Yeah, this dude doesn't care. Woo, he's looking sharp. Um, that's hilarious. Uh, if anyone knows who that is, do let me know. That's brilliant. Man, that's so cool. Should we let these guys out? How you doing? Are you getting zapped by radiation? Yes, you are. Okay, right, let's get back in. Oh, that didn't work. That didn't work either. Sorry. Bear with me, guys. Okay. Totally, totally awesome to be able to do this. So cool. This is kind of what I wanted to do in that video. Oh, look at the radioactive dust. Yeah, that's kind of what I wanted to do in the video uh, that I uploaded first, but um, I, I didn't know about this. and I should have checked. It just goes to show how uh, amazing the, uh, the explained forum is and what is what is in there, you know, you just never know. So I've learned my lesson there. And thank you again to my uh, um, 
the commenter who told me about this. So um, this is an awesome piece of uh, scenery that it just is really mind blowing. In fact, the amount of work that's gone into this. Um, I have actually um, going to donate because there's a, there's a donation button and uh, I'm absolutely going to donate because this is incredible. And the radiation is fading away. I mean the detail is just awesome. head back to the uh, oh, so cool so so cool very awesome okay so we'll head back to the uh, the helipad which is like an army base I guess oh well I've oversped it don't crash now What an awesome experience. I'll put the link in the description, guys, and uh, I really urge you to, to donate, even if it's just a few dollars, because, you know, this all takes an incredible amount of time and attention to detail, and I think it's, uh, it's an incredible experience to be able to fly around this area with this level of uh, detail. It's fantastic. All right, I think that's the army base dead ahead. to do this in VR. Hopefully you guys can see why. I know it's not such a great experience for you guys, but I really wanted to show off, uh, you know, the kind of thing you can do in VR. It's just, it's just amazing. It really is. Actually, is this the base? I don't think it is. I think it's further. There's actually a runway there as well. Is it over there? Oh no, I think... Yeah, I think this is it. A little bit further to go. This area is obviously decimated in terms of trees. Just the runway. It'd be cool to do a flight from Kiev to here in a little, I don't know, in a something. I might do that. I might get the ortho tiles for this part of Ukraine or Russia. That would be pretty awesome. Very cool. What a great experience. All right. Let's hope this landing is a great experience. I've got a feeling it's probably not going to be. We'll do our best.
slowly does it. Stay away from that. Terry me, Terry me, Terry me. Can't put it. Crashed into something. Ugh. Okay. Anyway, uh, not quite, but I'll take it. <laughs> Uh, there we go guys, I hope you've enjoyed this really fascinating flight, um, uh, I certainly have, wow what a great place to explore, and uh, yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments, um, this is a really nice aircraft to fly, I really need to study it and, and practice a whole lot more with it, um, ah, is it clickable in VR, oh yeah it is, yeah, need to really, um, be able to uh, fly this a bit more stably and I'm just not uh, not very comfortable with it but there we go um, practice makes perfect as they say so thanks again for tuning in guys and let me know your thoughts in the comments like and subscribe all that good stuff and I'll see you very soon take care